Oscar Gel. And today we're going to solve problem 11.1 and 11.14 of night. So the solve part A. We have what speed to a bicycle and its rider? A combined mass of 100 kilograms have the same momentum as a 1500 kilogram car traveling at 5.0 meters per second. Okay. So, so P is momentum equals mass times velocity. Right? So let's find the momentum of the car. So P car equals mass car times velocity car. This is equal to 1500 kilograms times 5 meters per second. We have 7500. Hundred kilogram mass kilogram meters per second. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to compare this to the momentum of the bike equals mass bike times velocity bike. And you want to know what speed do we need? So we already have. Momentum, we have the mass and we're going to find the speed. So I'm going to have momentum over mass of the bike equals the speed of the bike. So that's equal 7,500 meters per second times kilogram over 100 kilograms. It's going to be 75 meters per second. Now for part B. We have a 5,000 kilogram open train car. It's rolling on a frictionless rails at 22 meters per second. Then it starts pouring rain. A few minutes later, the car speed is 20 meters per second. What is the mass of the water collected by the car? OK. So we're going to make a drawing. So you have a car like this. Just rolling and it's open. The next thing. It starts raining. And it collects water. So the speed at the beginning is 22 meters per second. The speed at the end is 20 meters per second. So this is what we call an inelastic collision. So let's do a conservation. So we're going to have we're going to have our system to be the cart and the rain. So we're going to have the mass of the cart times the velocity of the cart equals the yeah, you're going to have this momentum at the beginning and the second momentum is the mass of the car plus the mass of the rain times velocity one okay so now we have to solve to find the mass of the rain so we're going to do MCBC. And then this is going to be over B1 equals mass C plus mass R. So we're looking for the mass of the rain. 
So we're going to have MCBC over B1. Okay, so this is the mass of the car, mass of velocity of the car, and velocity final. And we're going to be subtracting the mass of the car. So this is adding, it's going to be subtracting. And this is equal to the mass of the rain. So now just do this. We're going to have 5,000 times 22 over 20 minus 5,000. So 5,000 times 22 over 20 minus 5,000. So the mass of the rain is 500 kilograms. And that's the answer. Thank you so much for coming. See you next time.